a lot of people playing Final Fantasy 16 said that their game started to stutter a little bit. And so a lot of Xbox fans are starting to come out the woodworks and be like, yo, listen, this wouldn't have happened if y'all had an Xbox. You sure about that? <laughs> You sure about that? <laughs> <laughs> One dude says, if Final Fantasy 16 released on Xbox Series consoles, it would have been better because the Xbox hardware has better VRR support. It would have held it better on the Xbox. Redfall couldn't handle on the Xbox. So, this game is so incredibly broken. <laughs> Only people who have a problem with this game is people who don't own the game and don't have a PlayStation. Like everything on Xbox is on PC. Literally no positive reason to get an Xbox. Final Fantasy 16 released on June 22nd, which was like not too long ago and pretty much all the major game critics are giving it a nine out of 10 and above. It's also a PlayStation 5 exclusive, which has a lot of Xbox fans pissed off right now. What are they upset? Let's be, <laughs> let's be honest. Boo this man! But they got some fuel right now because a lot of people in playing Final Fantasy 16 said that their game started to stutter a little bit. And so a lot of Xbox fans are starting to come out the woodworks and be like, yo, listen, this wouldn't have happened if y'all had an Xbox. You sure about that? <laughs> you sure about that? <laughs> you got the chance to play Final Fantasy 16. Boy, and did I play the holy shit out that game, bro. <laughs> yeah, bro, the first boss uh, did give me a slight stutter, but it lasted like 0.7 seconds. Like, okay. like if you wasn't, if you weren't me and you weren't like, probably wouldn't have noticed it, feel me? It wasn't that bad. The boss fights are huge. You got a, a dude the size of the Empire State Building fighting some dude. Dude comes up to his finger like the Titan <laughs> dude sitting there. Douche, douche. They're huge, bro. There is a lot going on, bro. Okay, so yes, the systems are having a hard time. You think Xbox would have really been able to Hell handle no. it? Hell no. <laughs> Hell no. Hell, there's a reason why Xbox released their games the way they do. <laughs> One dude says, if Final Fantasy 16 released on Xbox, Xbox series consoles, it would have been better because the Xbox hardware has better VRR support, making it a smoother experience. Mm -hmm. This is why I say over and over again, VRR matters and Xbox series has the superior solution versus PlayStation. It would have held it better on the Xbox. Redfall couldn't handle on the Xbox. So, this game is so incredible. Cause I know right now there's a huge war going on on whether or not we're going to be seeing more 30 FPS games. But one thing that I feel like people are not realizing about game development, and we got this a lot in our Spider-Man video. I don't think people realize the amount of information that's on the screen at any given time. You get what I'm saying? And that's my point about the boss fight. The amount of shit that was on that screen at once was insane. <laughs> yeah, because it's like at that point, I think that a game like this with a console, PlayStation or Xbox, like you kind of get what you get. So you are going to have those different performance features. We went from Final Fantasy 16 wouldn't have been possible without the PlayStation 5 to its major issue would have been solved if it was on Xbox. He sounds like he owns an Xbox. <laughs> <laughs> sounds like he couldn't get the game. <laughs> it sounds like he needed something to talk about. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> hey, well, fuck Xbox, get a PC, er? <laughs> if you had to pick out of the three, I would say get a PC. Word. But if you were picking on getting two, get a PC and a PlayStation, yeah. there's literally no positive reason to get an Xbox. Like everything on Xbox is on PC. Like, there's no reason to <laughs> get an point. Xbox. Andrea Pininchini. She says, the story? Terrible. Mm. The combat, press the same button 30 times. Mm. Upside down, smiling face. And then somebody said, Andrea cries about PlayStation all the time instead of growing up and getting one herself. Sounds right. like she's just a hater. <laughs> I'm telling you guys, the only people who have a problem with this game is people who don't own the game and don't have a PlayStation. I just feel like people are complaining just to complain because I didn't see any lag there. Now there was this one dude where his PlayStation just caught on fire. <laughs> I, don't, I, I don't know how he did that. That's the first time I ever seen that. Oh, he deserved it 100%. Get all that shit off your PlayStation. <laughs> what the fuck? Dude. No. Holy shit. Oh, we're fucked. That Yo. shit don't got no space to breathe. Yeah, nowhere for it to yeah, breathe. Yeah, yeah. LEDs and all that extra. I'm like, Yo, what is wrong with you? It seems like Final Fantasy 16, people are gonna be playing it for a little while. Mm -hmm. It seems like it has some uh, replay value to it. Oh, definitely. I never really, again, I've never really been into Final Fantasy like that. But again, like when I play games like that, it never, like the way you be looking in the trailers, <laughs> the way you be playing it, it never looks like that for me, bro. Like it never looks like that. Like people be juggling characters, parrying and stuff. Like, I don't know if I'm just is very primitive. And I'm not just saying this to say this. You will enjoy this one because it's so it's so different from the rest of them. It's way 
drastically different from 15. Everything okay. you hated about 15 is not present in I wouldn't 16. say hate. It was more of a dislike. 15 was so new. I don't think I've ever played anything like it. I think I would have a better time watching gameplay footage of 15 rather than playing it because just the whole thing of the car and I remember the <laughs> mechanics of it. I think I went fishing at one point. Did I go fishing? <laughs> yeah. Like I went fishing. I'm like, what am I doing, bro? Like it just bro, felt like chilling. a mix of like, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like I'm like, what am bro, I so playing? This is life. <laughs> yeah. But like with this one, at least it seems like, all right, cool. Like I'm about to go up against my, like. I would, listen, I 100% recommend it. It's story driven and it, it's it, it's got a war vibe. I was just about to it's say that, but I didn't want to get my head cut off. Because 15 was ridiculously open world. This one's mm -hmm. more, it's open world, but it's 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 Focused. linear. Okay, it's linear, cool, so cool. It's, it's, it's got a war vibe. I was going to say, it reminds me of Elden Ring gameplay. Now, I don't it's, know it's if. More, it's more God of War vibe. Devil May Cry up in there. Oh, speaking of Devil May Cry, yo, the combat director from Devil May Cry actually worked on this game. That's I hard. guess that's why I love the combat so much. I am a Devil May Cry guy. Did you guys get a chance to play Final Fantasy 16 yet? Do you think that Xbox really would have been a better system to release this on? Or is PlayStation doing just fine? Let us know down in the comment section below. This has been Adler. I'm Clive Rosefield. And we'll see you in the next encounter. Peace!